Now, if your algorithm has these numerical knobs and dials, you must tune them. How do you do it? Well, I'm about to make it look way easier than it actually is in practice. If you have a very simple setting with one hyperparameter, what you can do is this. You take your training data set, there it is, and say you didn't have a data set withheld for tuning, you take one out. Okay, there's your fourth data set. But now this is your new training data set, that's your tuning data set, and what do we do? We're gonna use a good old trusty for loop. Begin with your hyperparameter set to its lowest possible setting. And now train your model with that setting, evaluate it on this tuning data set, and a store. Then, next setting, same thing, next setting, same thing, next setting, same thing. Tally up your results, and do you have a preference? I sure do. It looks to me like the third setting here is giving me the best performance, at least in training, and so that is the one that I'm going to prefer. It's not ideal, we know that there are a whole lot of issues with taking our results in training seriously, but at least this gives us a principled choice rather than having to have a guess or use our favorite number. So the result that comes out, once you have uh, picked your setting in set three, you'd, now you can just rerun it on the entire set, training set, and the result that comes out, you're gonna call it your tuned model. <laughs>